about this in the context of a, a, a student mood. Um, uh, having judged a couple of them in my in my years, uh, I think the, the the most essential thing about a good oral argument is is the the, the correct identification of what is itching the judges. Um, uh, students, uh, I think the, the the common error is to try and stick to a certain script which they have prepared, and uh, and, and you know and uh, come hell or high water, they have to finish that script. Yeah, I think that, that is a mistake because uh, judges um, are, uh, judges are, uh, are lawyers themselves, of course, are very senior judges, and, and they would have formed a certain idea of, of what the most interesting issues uh, the case presents are. Yeah. And they, don't, they, don't, they, want, they don't, do not want to hear from a prepared script. Yeah. They want you to respond to what they think is the most important aspect of the case. Yeah. So I think the, 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 the good oral argument must, uh, uh, must address uh, what the, the judge or judges think is the, the, the most interesting or important issue. Yeah. So I think that's uh, number one in, in any oral argument. Yeah. Argument is, I think, a, a different. Yeah, I think it's different from from written argument. Um, uh, the 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 way in which you speak, the 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 length and the brevity and the uh, the formalness or informalness yeah, of, of the <clears throat> of, of the situation. I mean, oral argument. I think I think tends to be rather less uh, uh, fettered by convention than uh, than right than written written argument. Yeah. So as to how informal you can get, I think it depends on how conservative or. or or progressive, the, the judge or the, the, the mood judge yeah, in front of you uh, thinks is uh, appropriate. Yeah. Presentation skills, uh, again, I, I think uh, uh, very personal. Yeah. I, I mean, I've seen uh, if effective uh, advocates who are uh, very, very eloquent and showy, yeah. right, um, able to crack a joke here and, uh, and uh, you know, um, uh, make very sharp cutting remarks. And I've also seen Surprisingly, rather more boring advocates. Yeah, they, they, you know, there's no, nothing very amusing or entertaining about them. But they are very methodical. They are very thorough, and they cover each point comprehensively. Yeah. So I, I think that there are two different models of, uh, uh, at least two different models of uh, advocacy and uh, an oral argument. I think, which uh, depending on the personality of the, the the student involved, I think um, uh, you will adopt uh, a style which is. Uh, one or the other, or somewhere in between, yeah, depending on the, the circumstances. It's the same as uh, with written skills here. Yeah. You have to do it again and again. Yeah. And uh, I think um, for oral skills, uh, uh, what um, I, I think some people have found very useful is to have uh, to, to watch videos of themselves yeah, doing the oral arguments yeah, and then having a debrief or post-mortem after that with, uh, with, a, with a mood or, or oral argument instructor to see how it can be improved or not improved. Yeah. Because uh, when you're actually making the argument, yeah, it's very difficult to, to, to imagine how the other party is, is looking at you. Yeah. Um, because how you perceive yourself to be is very different from how someone else who's listening to you perceives you to be. So I think it, 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 it helps a great deal if you can watch a video yeah, of, what, uh, um, of how you, you performed. Yeah. Uh, it, it could be simple things like, uh, uh, you know, you're using too many of these, um, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> like, like what I do. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, you might want to cut down on that. Um, you might want to cut down on the length of your sentences. Uh, you might want to, uh, for example, uh, look at the judges uh, in the eye rather than uh, look somewhere else. Uh, I think this will be, will be evident to you if you watch a video of yourself presenting. There's, there's no substitute for, for, for preparation. I mean, uh, the judges or, or moot judges yeah, are likely to be experts in whatever they are, in, in the field that they are, they are, they are uh, conducting the hearing uh, in. Yeah. So if you're not prepared, you'll be caught out straight away. Yeah. So um, you, you will need 
in fact, in oral argument, to be much more prepared yeah, because uh, you can never be sure what the judges will ask you. It could come in from the left field, yeah. and if you and if you don't and if you can't answer the question, yeah, uh, or rather, if you can answer the question, yeah, then uh, that would be very impressive indeed. Yeah, it shows that you you've done your groundwork and you know you know what you're talking about. Yeah.